attract people. This is your boy Zach, and uh, first of all, I want to thank you all of you who have just subscribed to my channel. I really appreciate you. Being a new year, we need to start a new year with a new resolution, with a new standard of goals, with a new vision, with a new energy, with a new mood. So today, we're going to talk about knowing your purpose in life. You see, when you know your purpose in life, this will help you live a life with integrity. Yeah. Knowing your purpose in life, this will help you live a life with integrity. And some of the ways that you need to understand when going to that journey of having a purpose in life, I will help you. I will clarify all the details on which, on how you should live a purpose in life. So, one of the main things before I start, make sure you click my subscription and uh, we click that notification bell down there and uh, just say in anything on the comment section and i will be very grateful to hear from you and uh, as, uh, as we continue make sure you, uh, you don't just be cool and i will take you very slow the strategies that you need to do to have a purpose life one of the things is that you need to create yourself with a positive environment yeah, you need to create yourself with a positive environment within your boundaries. Your boundaries, it may be your area, your place of work, it may be your place of residential, it may be within your family, it may be within your peer group, it may be within your political advisors, it may be between your friends, your, yeah. So, first of, first, of, first of all, you need to create a positive environment with anybody that you associate yourself with yeah this may be your friends your family your spouse your manager yeah your boss so you need first of all to create a positive relationship between you and anybody that you are accompanying yourself with this will help you foster that perspective of having a focused life Another thing is, when something bothers you, when you come across any injustice, don't shut up, speak out. Yeah, you see, it's very weird when we are in a situation whereby that situation you don't like or it keeps on bothering you and you're just there sitting, saying nothing or commenting or complimenting or complimenting nothing about the situation to make yourself focused to make yourself purposed in life when anything bothers you when anything comes between that you didn't like or you you're not in a way of accepting its situation just speak out try and reconcile try and talk about it yeah try and say if something that is bothering you for example, there's an agenda in your company organization that is coming up with your co-workers and uh, that thing, you're not in the same position with it or you're not supporting it. The way that you're going to take it, it will, it will determine how purpose your life is going to be. You see, you cannot see that, you cannot hear or you cannot hear that someone I'd say I'd say something about you and it's trending and you're just there talking nothing about it. This thing will destroy your future, this thing will destroy your mood, this thing will destroy your steps, this thing will destroy your concentration. So you need to stay focused and when something bothers you, just speak it. Just try and talk it out. Don't just sit in an environment that is not conducive to yourself it will you are destroying yourself if something is not correct if something is not going the right way that you intended to it to go the right way please don't speak down on it speak up another thing is know your interest yeah many people 
we all have our different interests. So you need to understand your interest. You need to understand your area of interest. Yeah. It may be hobby, a hobby, it may be at work, it may be at your family, it may be at just understand your interest. These interests will help you know your purpose in life. It's through these interests because those interests are your daily doings. Yeah, interest comes from anything that you have, you frequently do, anything that you frequently consider yourself in it, that you just find yourself doing it. After work, what, a, what is that that you like doing after work? What is that that you like doing when you are not with your family, when you are not with your wife, when you are not with your kids? What is that that you keep on doing? This, this, is, this, is, this will help you improve your focused and purposed life. So try and understand your area of interest. At different level, try and understand what which area are you interested in. Another thing is declare what you want and do it. You know, it's just a matter of time that it will tell what you, your decision it was meant to. It doesn't matter. How people are saying about you it doesn't matter how pages are writing about your decision it doesn't matter how anybody is saying about you but what you are intend to do what you declare it that's what matter so when you want something just de declare it when you want something and you love it just declare it and do it it's only through that you will have and you will have you'll accomplished a purpose life. Another thing is listen to feedbacks. Always listen to feedback. When you do anything, when you have something, when you come up with an, an idea, when you come up with an objective and uh, it goes out, and people are talking, 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 try and listen to them, try and be keen to what they say because it's only through those feedbacks it will help you improve or upgrade your decisions. So listen to feedbacks for anything that you have done. If there is a progress that you are doing or there is a project that you are currently doing, just do it. After it, it has done, listen to feedbacks. Those feedbacks, it will help you foster your improvement on living a purposed life. And research all the scientists in the world prove this that living a happy life, living a happy life helps health, good health. Living happy improves health. Yeah. You cannot just live being sad and you expect to be healthy. No. But when you are happy, your health is upgraded. When you are happy, your mindset is clear. When you are happy, your, your concentration is focused. When you are happy, everything is equilibrium. So be content. Don't just be there. Don't just live because people are living. Live with a purpose. Live with determination, live with purpose. Don't just live, don't just do things because people are doing. Live a unique life. We are all unique on our own level of life. We are nowhere we, we can be the same. You cannot be me and I cannot be you. So live your life to the fullest.